Welcome. Today we're gonna talk about the animals in Egypt. Please subscribe for more amazing content. For more information on this in full coverage, check out the link below in the description. Egypt Geography The Fertile Nile Valley bifurcates Egypt between north and south. But other than a few other oases, the majority of the country is a vast desert ringed by the Mediterranean Sea, Gulf of Suez, Gulf of Aqaba, and the Red Sea. But desert doesn't mean barren. Since Egypt is a transcontinental country, it sits in two continents, Asia and Africa. The country enjoys a high biodiversity rank. Egypt Animals In prehistoric days, Egypt's climate was cooler and wetter. At that time, giraffes, hippos, and ostriches roamed the land. But things changed and those species moved south and west. In fact, very few animals endemic to Egypt still live there. Native species that stayed put include the Egyptian weasel, pale gerbil, Machilogen's gerbil, flower shrew, and the Nile Delta toad. Animals commonly found in Egypt include Rupel's fox, aka the desert fox, the lesser Egyptian jaroba, spotted sand grouse, and the white-crowned wheat ear. What Egypt lacks in ungulates and other mammals it makes up for with birds. Like other nations in southern Europe and northern Africa, Egypt sits along a major migratory route. As such, approximately 480 species spend all or part of their year in the nation. Vultures, storks, egrets, pelicans, eagles, owls, and falcons all reside in Egypt. Endangered Animals of Egypt According to Egypt today, 70 species in the country are currently endangered to some degree. The Sinai Batten Blue Butterfly is one of them. Listed as critically endangered by the IUCN, it is one of the world's smallest butterflies and needs Sinai time to survive. Additionally, Sinai batons are notoriously bad flyers and therefore can't relocate, making it especially vulnerable. Rim gazelles are another endangered species in Egypt. Also known as horned gazelles, African sand gazelles, and loaders gazelles, the species has adapted to desert life over centuries. However, fewer than 2,500 remain in the wild, as they are falling prey to poachers and habitat loss. Other Egyptian endangered animals include the Dorcas gazelle, Barbary sheep, and the African wild ass. The five most dangerous animals in Egypt. Egypt has its fair share of dangerous animals. Some are gigantic, and others can land on your neck without detection, some live on land, and others reside underwater. Whichever the case, when in Egypt, be on alert for dangerous animals. 1. Nile Crocodile Nile crocodiles can grow 5 meters long and weigh up to 700 kilograms. The behemoth reptiles can be found in southeast Egypt. Crocodile on human attacks are infrequent, but 50% of them prove fatal. 2. Egyptian Cobra They love to hang around in wet, grassy fields, which is why most Egyptian cobra bites occur in rural areas. Loaded with both cytotoxin and neurotoxin, the snake's venom is highly lethal and can result in heart failure. 3. Hippopotamus Hippos have a gentle reputation, but the lumbering, semi-aquatic ungulates can be quite dangerous. While they won't look to you as a meal, since hippos are herbivores, they weigh several tons and can easily crush humans. And yes, hippos have been known to charge when they feel threatened. 4. Mosquito Sometimes, the most dangerous things come in small packages. Such is the story of the mosquito. The lethal flyer is considered one of the most deadly since they carry fatal diseases and strike without warning. 5. Lionfish Lionfish are undeniably cool-looking, with their artistic mohawk fins and fringe. They're also exceptionally dangerous. The colorful swimmers carry poisonous loads similar to snake venom. Instead of biting their targets, they inject spiny tentacles to deliver the toxin. Fortunately, lionfish aren't typically aggressive with humans, but attacks are not out of the question. National Animal of Egypt Like the United States, the national animal of Egypt is an eagle, the stepped eagle. The majestic bird is a collage of brown feathers with a distinct yellow beak. Its vocalization sounds like a barking crow, but stepped eagles are notoriously taciturn and rarely heard. Thank you for checking this video. If you wish to give your opinion, please comment below, we'd love to hear from you. Be sure to hit that subscribe button and we will see you next time.